رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين. Today is the first day of Ramadan this year 1433 and it is 20th of July. My dear respected brothers and sisters, the month of Ramadan is the month of victory for Muslims. The main victories that Muslims achieved throughout history have been achieved during the month of Ramadan. The Battle of Badr, as we all know, the battle that Allah Allah called it Al-Furqan, Bayn al haqq wal Batil, took place in Ramadan. Then the conquer of Mecca, when the Prophet ﷺ took over Mecca, and it is a turning point in the history, took place in Ramadan. They also said that uh, Al-Andalus was conquered by Muslims or was opened by Muslims in the month of Ramadan in year 91. Uh, the, the, the Fath of Al-Andalus, Andalusia, which is known as Spain now, was a turning point in terms of the spread of Islam in Europe. Uh, also, they said that historians confirm that the Battle of Amoria, led by Al-Mu'tasim, the Abbasi Caliphs, in 223, uh, took place in Ramadan when the king, when uh, the Muslims defeated the Romans defeated them badly in the Battle of Al Amoria. And uh, I remember that uh, that I read that Al Mu'tasim, when he was annoyed by the Romans, and they, uh, one of the kings of the Romans killed 20,000 Muslims, uh, Al Mu'tasim became so annoyed. And he consulted his people and he said, What is the most important city in the Romans' land? And they said, Amoria. It is even more important than Rome or Constantinople. So he decided to uh, invade that or attack them because of what they have done. So uh, this battle of uh, Amuriya took place in Ramadan, subhanAllah, and Allah gave them victory. And even um, uh, either in, in this battle or in other battles, according to some historians, they said, let us start the battle in Jum'ah when the Khatibs are making dua for us. So this is another victory Muslims achieved in the month of Ramadan. Uh, also, the very famous battle of Ain Jalut. Ain Jalut was another battle or another turning point in the history of Islam. As you know that the Tatars invaded the whole Muslim uh, land and they started uh, and they demolished Khilafah in 654. Uh, in Baghdad. They demolished that and they killed thousands of people. Uh, they destroyed the whole city. All of us know about what they have done there. They threw, uh, they, they, knew, they destroyed the civilization of Islam there in, in Baghdad. And they were moving towards Asha and towards Egypt. And they were uh, planning to destroy the whole Islamic Khilafah and the whole Islamic civilization. And then Muslims stood against them and defeated them, Allah had papers, defeated them in the battle of Ain Jalud in 658 or 656. Then there was another battle, important battle, the battle of Shakha. And in that battle, Shaykh al-Islam ibn Taymiyyah fought against the Tatars again, and it was a very important battle that took place in 702. Last year, in 1432, Muslims in Libya took over the capital of Libya, Tiropoli, and they were able to kick al qaddafi from Libya, and it was a turning point in their history, in fact, in the history of Libya after the dictatorship of al qaddafi for over than 30 years. And this year, my dear respected brothers and sisters, Muslims in Syria, inshallah, we pray to Allah wa to give them the victory in Damascus and they will be able to take over Damascus and the whole Asham in this month of Ramadan. We ask Allah wa to give them this victory which will be a turning point in their life and in the life of Muslims. We ask Allah wa to grant them this victory, inshallah, in this month of Ramadan. Say Ameen, Ameen. And inshallah, it, you will see that it is a matter of days and we will hear the good news from Syria that Muslims took over the
Damascus and took over the whole of Syria. Jazakum Allah khairan. Assalamu alaikum.